Hi everyone. Welcome to this video. We will show you how the Odoo 3CX CRM connector works. This app helps you to connect your 3CX communication system with Odoo CRM. So all your calls, chats and customer interactions are managed in one place. So let's just get started. First, let's start with the configuration. So head over to the contacts in Odoo. Here you can find menu for 3CX CRM configuration. So just click on that. A wizard will open containing your Odoo URL and the access token. Then click on generate and download. Now let's head to the 3CX admin panel. Here we need to head to integrations. Here in CRM integration we have to add the config file which we have downloaded from the 3CX CRM configuration wizard. So just click on add template. This select the config file and enable this checkbox. This one is for call journaling and this one is for chat journaling. So just save it. Now what we need to do is to move to settings and integration. Here select this open contact URL using server side CRM integration. So what will happen whenever any call is received then when we answer the call it will automatically automatically open the contact URL in your Odoo. So for that we need to enable it. Now another thing, another thing we, which we need to do is we need to move to admin then system and then phone book. Here you can find the button called options. Here you need to select this option if you want to match the exact number which is received when any call is received. So you just click on that and OK. The toy was for the configuration. Now let's see what happens when you receive a call. Here you can see if the number is not in Odoo, it will create automatically a new contact. Also, when you receive a call for the first time, then it will have this default name containing a number, which you can change it. Also, when a call is received, it automatically opens the contact in the Odoo. Now, for example, if we received a call from the same number, then let's see what happens.
Here you can see next time the same number calls, Odoo will recognize it and show the saved contact name. Now, move to the third contact in contact model in Odoo. Here you can see the contact. In chatter, you can see the call details containing entity time which is contact, call type, which is inbound, and the duration. Also, let's see what happens if you missed any call. If you miss the call, no worries, the system will automatically create a follow-up activity in context timeline, so your team doesn't miss it. So, let's check it out. So, for that, move to that contact. Here you can see it. A missed call follow-up. Also, in your chatter you can see, call tap missed call for the list call activities. Now, let's check the live chat feature. If a person sends you message via live chat and that number is in chill, then a new contact is created for them. Let's see it. If you click on this dialed with, then only then the chat journaling is done in chatter of that contact. Here you can see a new contact is created for that customer. It has this email and the name. Also, you can find the chat, the chat duration, and the messages also. Now, let's see what happens if a live chat person calls you. So whenever any person calls you from the live chat, then it will be created in Odoo as a live chat caller. And the call detail is added in the chatter. Here you can see the call details in the chatter, which have this object, the date, the duration of the call, and the details containing with new code and to give which 3CX user. Now, what happens if you save the number with or without a country code and you receive the call with country code or without country code? Then how the connector handles that? So let's just check it out. Now, for example, if we have this customer without country code, and in 3CX, if we now let's see what happens if you receive the call from that person.
here you can see Odoo will automatically match the contacts even if you have the country code or without country code. Now for example if you want to call directly from here without manually dialing in dial thread in 3CX. So what we need to do is move to the 3CX. Here we need to go to apps. Then we need to download this extension. Which I have previously downloaded. So let me show you what it can do. So now we need to go to our contact and click. So let's just click on call button. Here you can see it automatically dials the contact number so we don't have to do it manually. Now one more thing for example if we received a check from the live chat. Then also from here you can open that contact by clicking on CRM. You, you can see that contact. That was a quick look at how the Odoo 3CX CRM connector works. If you like a personalized demo, feel free to contact us via email or Skype. Thanks for watching.